Happy New Year, Rutherford. I hope everybody had a safe, healthy, and happy holiday season. After the difficulties of 2020, I'm looking forward to what we can accomplish in Rutherford in 2021. Last week, the council and I participated in the annual organizational meeting following the swearing in of Councilman McGowan, Councilman Guzman, and Councilman Coakley. Please join me in welcoming Matt Coakley for his first year as councilman. I know he'll work hard for the borough to make it the best place possible for us all to live. I'd also like to thank former Councilman Eddie Naruki for his service to the borough and wish him well in his next endeavors. The council and I have some exciting things planned for this year and I look forward to presenting a detailed version of these things later this month. Unfortunately, COVID numbers continue to climb in Rutherford and elsewhere. While vaccines are certainly a light at the end of a very dark tunnel, we must remain vigilant and urge all residents to continue to practice responsible behavior by wearing masks, refraining from social events. We must do everything in our power to keep schools open and our community safe. I'd also like to remind you to continue to support our local businesses during these difficult times as much as possible. As always, information for the COVID numbers um, in Rutherford and beyond are located on the borough website. The health department continues to work diligently to provide updates, updated information, and I ask that you all continue to stay engaged, in, <clears throat> informed, and safe during these times. I'd also like you to keep the Rutherford families that have been impacted by COVID-19 in your thoughts at this time, and I hope everybody continues to stay COVID smart. Thank you very much.